Hey everyone, before we begin, I just wanted to take a moment and express my gratitude for the overwhelming support you guys have been showing me for the content. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. Unfortunately, there was a slight hiccup during the recording session. I regret to inform you that the amazing record-breaking run by Selfs was not captured. He completed it in an astonishing time of 3 minutes and 15 seconds. However, I do have good news. If any of you are up for the challenge, I invite you to create your own ships and attempt to beat that time. The ship file can be found on my Discord server under the announcements channel. I posted it there, I think, last week sometime. Uh, I'll also leave a link to my Discord in the doodly-doo. To make up for the missed recording, I have scheduled a dedicated session on Saturday, 11 a.m. Central Standard Time, immediately following the release of this video. I'll be recording runs throughout the afternoon until about 1 or 2 p.m. So mark your calendars for tomorrow and go ahead and join me for some exciting attempts at breaking records. Thank you once again for your ongoing support and without further ado, let's get this video rolling. All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is The Blade Tardigrade and this is a game called Cosmeteer. We're messing around in the multiplayer today. I've brought in this ship that I've designed. I shouldn't say I've designed it. Uh, I took inspiration from Micro Mouse. I saw a YouTube video the other day and I was like, you know what? That's kind of cool. Um, so I've made a little Micro Mouse racetrack and we're going to see if what's his name? Johnny Boy over here can fit his ship through this maze. Uh oh. Yeah, he seems to have made his ship a little too big. Each player is going to have 10 minutes to make it through and then whenever they take out the cockpit and the game ends is what their time will be. We're going to see who can make the fastest time. We're going to see who can make the fastest time and uh, yeah, claim victory via that. Uh, since Johnny Boy is a little bit too wide to make it through. Uh, just squeezing through the walls. It looks like he's going to try to blast through the walls. I've put a stipulation out. Uh, I've changed it a few times because it seemed too easy for people to just make a nuke stick and then drill their way to the center. And I was like, that's not in the spirit of the game. So I've allowed people to break walls. I've allowed people to break walls as long as their ship is cheaper than 75k <laughs> at about 100k they can still make a decent nuke stick but around here in this price point people are gonna have a really difficult time it looks like yeah he's gonna target these charges right off the bat i had to connect everything so these were passageways when i was designing the map uh they're no longer passageways as you can see because I had to have the entire ship kind of connected together. But they are destructible, so if you have a weapon or something, you can blast through them. However, you don't need a weapon to get through this maze. You only need speed, to be completely honest. Yeah, something tells me this drilling tactic is not going to be very fast, so I guess we'll, um, we'll just chat for a minute. Might also, I might also skip further on, but I guess we'll chat for a little bit. I don't know what to chat about at this point. Oh yeah, this map, I'm going to be running it, uh, what's today? Today is June 4th that I'm recording this. I'm going to try to get this video to come out on Thursday or Friday this week, whatever days those are. But this next upcoming weekend on... I think Sunday. Yeah, Sunday. We're going to all get together, everybody who has designed ships, and try this map again. I'm also going to try to design another map before then uh, that's a little bit wider, a little bit more forgiving, so that people can kind of race their ships in that way. Yeah, so if you want to participate, feel free. Also, if you have any map ideas or if you have a map that you have designed, when you want me to feature it, by all means, send it my way. I will, uh, or yeah, send it over the Discord. You can put it in the ideas area. I can't remember exactly what it's called. Let me look at it real quick. Which channel is it?
yeah ideas and questions just throw it down in the ideas and questions area and i will yeah use your map probably to see what's going on i'm also i'm not used to being a participant in the games i'm used to being an observer so i tried to click on this ship earlier to see what was inside i can't do that <laughs> i just gotta sit here and and watch he's having a really hard time getting through so yeah while we're waiting for all that to get done i'm gonna just i'm just gonna go ahead and make a cut to whenever he's done if he even makes the 10 minute timer Uh oh okay yeah it appears that i messed up and i left the dang circle of death on which is uh that's my bad i definitely should have checked that i told myself i was gonna turn it off and i didn't do it so i guess this one's gonna end a little early but this definitely i don't think is gonna be the winner anyway he's been going on for about what do you call it yeah, like six minutes now. Just drilling through armor. I And I don't think it's going to work. So we'll just move on to the next one. Nobody else was ready at the moment. So Yo-Yo managed to make some modifications to his ship. And uh, yeah, get rid of the side thrusters there. It looks like essentially the same thing. He's just swapped some thrusters around. Let's go ahead and yeah, figure out if he can make it through the maze. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work. I think he's going to have a very difficult time making any kind of turning maneuver. All right, here we go. He's approaching the entrance of the maze. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, quite painful to watch. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, see, the issue is if you make the ship too long, it's not going to make it past these corners. But if you make the ship also too wide, it's not going to fit through the raceways here. So, you know, it's a it's a very careful balancing act of not being too long and also not being too wide. Very difficult, very difficult design challenge. Looks like he's trying to reset. There we go. Yeah, not easy to fit the exact same sized piece together. Oh, man. Oh, almost there. It's like parts that are perfectly machined to fit together. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Man, this is raising my blood pressure. I can't watch this. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> this is so close. Can he slide while he's connected to the ship? Unclear. Oh, no. Now he's stuck on the other side. If only there were a way to jettison these crew cabins at the beginning of the match. There we go. Okay. He's managed... To get in uh oh he got caught somehow uh very strange indeed <laughs> i don't understand what he's caught on uh but somehow he managed to get caught which is a little unfortunate i guess we could try to help him out <laughs> yeah this makes sense oh man yeah he's very stuck 
I'm gonna help him out because I don't feel like he should be stuck like that. There we go. Oh no, he's still stuck. <laughs> oh no. This is a nightmare. Oh. Okay. He managed to kind of slide through. <laughs> What is going on? I want to know how he's getting caught on here. How the game is registering that he needs to be stuck. Very interesting that the point defense is having to shoot its way out of the armor that it's inside of. <laughs> oh, this is goofy. Very goofy indeed. I think it is the point defense getting caught on the armor here. I think he needs to keep firing the point defense, if anything. Very strange. The goings on. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this here, because I already know that this ship... Well, we'll wait until he breaks out of this. We'll see what he does from here. There we go. Alright. He is a little loose. All right. He's managing to make some turns. The only issue is he's only making these turns because the outer uh, outer shell of the maze is disconnected entirely. I don't think he would be able to do this if it were connected. I don't think he'd be able to make the turns. But, you know, if he makes me eat my words, I will eat my words. Oh, no. Is he caught again? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, there we go. All right. He's in the raceway. He's somehow caught again. Oh, this is painful. I don't think I have a way to disconnect that one either. Oh, I do, yeah. I do have a way to disconnect it, but I feel like I already helped him a lot with the first one. I don't feel that it's fair. All right. Uh-oh. That did not get him unstuck this time around. That is no bueno. I think, yeah, I think he's just stuck now. All right. Yeah, I'm calling it, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think he's going to be able to make it because he's not going to be able to make this kind of movement with that uh, maneuverable of a ship. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and call it. Let's move on to the next one. Well, forgot to hit record there for a second, but here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to give Zameko another attempt here. He's revised his ship to be a little bit lower profile. Yeah, it looks like he's taken the bumpers off the front. He's actually put them on the back here, but gotten rid of the armor that was there. I can get a slightly different shape. All right, there we go. He's managed to take off his crew quarters. Now approaching the maze. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> oh, no. Kind of missed the front edge there. I'm loving the way that Sales did it. He basically slammed against the side and then had a maneuver to flip him around into the perfect position to enter the maze. Here we go. Zameko is now in the maze and running. He's very quick when moving down corridors because he has two thrusters facing towards the rear. Yeah, there we go. It's making it around the edges.
There we go. I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so that you all can see it. Dang. Seems to come and go as it pleases whenever the cockpit is and isn't visible. All right, he's making it through. Oh, there we go. He was getting stuck here a lot on the last run. There we go. Definitely a lot less stuck this time around, which is good. Ooh. Oh no. He's pretty uh He's pretty stuck in that position. That is unfortunate. Okay, there we go. He made it. He lost a little bit of time, but uh I did think that was gonna be a run ender for him. He did make it though. So I'll give him that. Here we go, a few tight corners. Hopefully it doesn't get stuck again. There we go, making it around. All right, now he's on a straightaway. This is where his ships, his ship shines. He's making good time. He's about three minutes into the match. into the match, into the race. All right, here we go. A lot of straightaway action here. It might save him some time. Um, definitely hasn't beat the record so far. Ladies and gentlemen, the record is going to be three minutes and 15 seconds for actually running the maze. Uh, that will be the time to beat this weekend if you guys want to come and try your hand feel free i will be jumping on sunday next week uh, i'll put out i'll try to put a time in the description of the youtube video when it goes live because i should know closer to when the video goes live well what times i'll have available exactly on sunday i'm a very busy person i've got like 20 side projects going at any given moment which is uh a little overwhelming on top of the fact that you know i need to do just general life things as well here we go he's coming up on the cockpit he's been going for almost five minutes now oh what are we doing there we go he makes it coming in at i think four minutes and 42 seconds all right here we go ladies and gentlemen robo bunny is going to try his hand again he's bringing in like a little car box looking ship i'm gonna call it like a crab design because the uh, the cockpit is not facing forward it is facing to the side therefore crab definitely a crab i like the uh the charges up here at the front i'm wondering why yeah i don't know why you would need three rather than just two or, sorry, not two, but just one. <laughs> but I guess he's bringing... He's bringing three. He knows better than me, you know. I'm, I'm gonna let him do it. I'm thinking he might bust this first... Little charge area here. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh. There we go, gotta realign. Yeah, there we go. He takes out this portion, and now he's in. There he goes. He's racing his little car, his little crab car, as he goes. Very similar to Sales' attempt, I think. Yeah. There we go. Look at that. This seems to be the design of choice. Very maneuverable in these turns. Good heavens. 
You're all master pilots in Cosmeteer, by the way. Just letting you guys know. Like, look at that. It's just... It's just snaking through. Oh. A little little caught there. Looks like it's been two minutes so far. I think the time to beat was three minutes and 15 seconds. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure it was three minutes and 15 seconds was the time to beat... Oh, this may, this may be faster. Yep, he's coming up on the time. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. Making it through all the corners. You know, I thought about making just like a race, a racetrack for this um, that was put in the ideas. For on the Discord, there's an ideas channel that people can uh, post their ideas and we can try to do competition of such type. And it was like, oh, I'll make a maze because my brain was like micro mouse, make a micro mouse maze. And I, I'm actually really happy with how that turned out. All right, what are we at? Let's see, is it four minutes? No, I think this is three minutes and 20 seconds. Hmm. Yeah, he's got to self-destruct the reactor. Yeah, I guess we'll count it from the time that he got in here. Oh. What the heck? <laughs> Alright, we'll pretend like he blew his reactor and won there. A uh, little bit slower than sales.